hello community i hope you are doing good in this discussion we will see what is uninstall hook in odoo and how to use this hook and we will see the real task as and in case you missed this discussion about what is post init hook and with how to use that one with the real task as please check link is given in the description and if you want to learn more about odoo with different topics you can visit the playlist here in this playlist you can see here odoo development here all the different topic wise playlist also available with different test cases here and if you need any support here you can visit the about page you can send your query to this email address plus source code is also available in the github and we have also different social media pages you can follow to get the latest notification and you can also support this channel using two ways buy me coffee and the paypal all right so let's back to our main topic like how we can implement uninstall hook in Odoo. So first thing is we need to clear about the hooks here and especially the uninstall hook right. So here you can see we have like 52 modules installed in this database right. Now there is a one scenario let's say if I will uninstall this module and I want to perform a specific operation once this module uninstall right that time we can use this uninstall hook feature same as the post and the init hook right and if you don't know what is pre init hook and the post init hook please check link is given in the description also you can see the introduction part of the available hooks in Odoo so you will have a clear picture about the hook so let's say I'm going into the editor and we already created a new module for the especially for the hook you can see here the init file and the manifest file in the manifest file you can see we implemented two hooks the pre init hook and the post init hook right and we need to also use the init file the main init file for this module now like let's say i want to do some operations while uninstall the module so that time we can use here uninstall underscore hook that's it and this is a prefix name here and if you not provide any the specific name it won't be called this method so and here we have to mention the specific method name the method name could be anything you can as per your requirement you can add any name here so for for here like I'm using like this weblands uninstall hook and here let's say I will use I will create a new method like this underscore weblands underscore hook and here we have to provide two prefix parameter which is a CR and another is a registry If you will not provide here it will rise the error all right so make sure you have to compulsory use these two parameters so now let's see here we will add here simple print statement like your module on uninstalled from uninstall hook right and now I'm trying to restart the service and let me open this terminal let me find out here module and i'm trying to uninstall this module right so you can see here this module already uninstalled and you can see this method out of this print statement automatically print here due to this uninstall hook feature now we can perform a two operations here using a row query and using over a method all right so here first thing is cr dot execute and let's say here in the contact you can see the wet number is one two three four five six seven eight nine zero right for i think almost all the partners having the same text id now like this text id we already filled using the post init hook method now we are trying to roll back these changes right so what i will do here is like i will 
remove this default one two three four five as a blank so let's say update res underscore partner set wet equal to blank where wet equal to one two three four five six seven eight nine and zero if this is found the wet number it should be a blank here now i will try to commit these changes and i will try to restart the service one one more time why i am trying to restart the service because i change in the python side right this is compulsory now let's say i will try to uninstall this module oops oh we are on i'm trying to install this module now you can see in the context here you can see we have this value still right and now i'm trying to uninstall this module and here you can see in the context here you can see it's blank now right so you can also do some operations as per the requirement like this using the raw query now what about the orm method right directly i can access orm method that is also possible using this way like we have to provide env as a variable name this is not a prefix name i just use like this and now we have to compulsory import api and the super i super user id all right now here we have to use api dot environment and here we have to pass out three parameters the first one is the database instance then after we have to pass here the super user id and here we have to pass as a context all right and then we will ready to use orm method to call the orm methods right so let's say i already implemented one method in this student school underscore student module in the modules you can see this method hello underscore hook for res partner right what it does like it print a hello hook math print statement and then we added here one for loop it will search all the current record and it will display like it will display in console a display underscore name field all right so we are trying to simple call this method so what i will do here is like i will call here hello underscore hope method directly like this if you remember in the python side in the model side we can use like this right I'll just start partner and then the method name but here we don't need to use the self all right so that's the main difference here and why because we already created a new environment instance directly like this way now I'm trying to restart the service and i'm trying to apps go to apps find that specific module name like hook trying to install this hook and i'm going to again in apps and i'm simple trying to uninstall this module and now you can see here the uninstall hook automatically call and it also called this res partner method hello underscore hook and those are the records of the res partner with display underscore name so like this way you can also call or a method like this way to perform the specific operation now it's up to you you want to use like this or you want to call from the or method it's up to you I just show you the basic idea how you can call or what is the uninstall hooks post init hook and the pre init hook all right so this is up to you now like based on the requirement you can call anything using the specific hooks and in case you have any doubt related 
on Instagram. Please comment below and see you in next session.